Hey, Fight fans, it's Michelle Joy Phelps with Fight Hub TV, powered by Stagefront VIP, and I'm joined now with the Nordic nightmare himself, Robert Hellenius, the man who literally saved this card. Um, first of all, I don't want to go on repeating the same questions <laughs> over and over and over, because I know you're probably absolutely gobsmacked at this point, but respect to you for Thank getting you. through the line Thank for you. everybody who wants Thank to speak with you. Um, right about now, you know, taking the opportunity on such a last minute, mm -hmm. you just fought literally yeah. last weekend. Yeah. How are you feeling? Are you not feeling like just completely burnt out? No, no, yeah, after this press conference, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Talking too much, yeah. but but uh, yeah, I, I need to go to the training uh, today just to, to keep it up. Mm. Uh, I've I done Sunday, Monday, Tuesday trainings, like, uh, I feel good, I feel good. Of course, Sunday was a little bit sore, but I took a little bit off. I just went for a small run and, and just mm. some, you know, shake it off right. type of training. And uh, yeah, I feel, I feel good, I feel ready. This wouldn't be the first time that we've seen a last minute replacement come in and shake up the entire heavyweight division. Yeah. Is that your goal? That's my plan. Mm -hmm. And I think that's why I'm here. Mm -hmm. a, a win over Anthony Joshua not only puts you, benchmarks your name um, and catapults you to stardom basically overnight, but it will also put you in line with the likes of Usyk, Fury and so forth. Um, just you know, thoughts overall on, on what this moment and this fight could mean for you in your career. Everything. This means everything because I've been chasing world championship for 15 years, and I have not gotten there. I have some injuries here mm -hmm. and there, and got big fights. Back in 2009, uh, I knocked out like Samuel Peter, Lemon Brewsters, and stuff. Uh, Sergey Lyankovic, also old heavyweight champions. But uh, then I had a really bad injury, so I've been long away. But I've been in this game for a long, long time, mm -hmm. and I think this is my golden ticket. Mm -hmm. It is a golden ticket for you. Um, Derek Chisor has made a, a strong statement at the press conference. I don't know if you saw, but he said that he feels like Anthony Joshua is going to take you out within three rounds. W would you like to respond to that? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then uh, Chisor is going to be, be surprised that mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to beat Anthony Joshua mm -hmm. on Saturday. On the night when you fought uh, Deontay Wilder, were you a bit taken aback by his emotional response um, at the post-fight press conference? Yeah, I, I saw, saw it much later when I was flying back home, but yeah, he, he's a good guy and he has his heart in the right place. I have much respect for him. The fight, of course, didn't go so well for me. I've been training for that fight for one year, but... but uh, you know, this is boxing and that stuff happens. Should you win this weekend though? Because you know Anthony... I, I use the words win, <laughs> so yeah. Sorry, yeah. I have to yeah. refrain from, yeah. from being biased, yeah. but um, win. win, you win, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that could potentially put you back in line maybe with even a rematch against Deontay Wilder considering that that is the fight that everyone is looking toward at mm. this point um, past this weekend. Yeah, I hope so. I hope so to redeem myself and show my word. Mm -hmm. Any any final words in regards to this weekend? Anything you would like to say before we wrap it up? It's going to be a really, really good fight. I've been training really hard. Uh, it's going to be fireworks and glorious. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, thank <laughs> you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Bye, bye, fans. Thank you so much for watching this video and make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV and give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV on Twitter and on Instagram. We appreciate it guys.